Hey guys, it's Brenda from My Wee Wee Runs Cradle. Today I have my Sienna Roshin. She is a Nino sculpt by Chenza Dolls and she was reborn by Canadian artist Kelly. And Kelly is on Reborns.com under Kelly's Weekend Nursery. So this is the basket I had in the last video. I just quickly showed you that I brought this up from the basement in my storage and it fits her very well. Um, some of you asked me where I got this beautiful basket and it comes with a cloth liner. This is, I bought like I own like four, at least four, but I think five of these from Walmart. Um, I bought them years and years ago in the laundry section. So this is actually a wicker laundry basket. They still may have them for sale, but not really sure. I didn't look. So Sienna is a big girl. She is so heavy, but I love her. Wait, I can't even hold her outstretched, but Look at this blanket I put in here. So all I did with this laundry basket was there's this thicker, like it's pretty thick blanket. And this is a fleece blanket. And there's another fleece blanket underneath just to give it some height and softness. And I just folded them down to fit. So that's what it looks like. I like it. So, I'm going to see if Sienna can fit into that outfit that I had brought out for her. Now she is, oh, can you see her? So, Sienna is wearing a Care Bear outfit from Pat Pat that I bought long time ago and um i like how it fits on her it's a romper sleeper but let's see what size i wonder if this is the kind that you can like, you know how some sleepers... No, you can't. You know how some sleepers with the legs can turn into a bag kind of sleeper? This isn't. Oh, she is heavy. Okay. And I'll take this off. <laughs> oh, look at their chubby arms. She's like, no, why? I'm so cold now. <laughs> okay, I'll put this. Okay, so this is a pat pat. And it's a size 0 to 3. But it's a big 0 to 3. I would say this would even be like a, a three to six size, but let's see if that three month size sleeper that I have, well, I had two things. I had this for her. I don't even know if this will fit, but at least it's adjustable. And then they came. This beautiful dress. Okay. This outfit. <laughs> I think it will fit her. I think she'll look so sweet in this. So this is a George, which is a Walmart brand, three months. And I think it'll look really cute. Um, I also have this 
really pretty vintage Winnie the Pooh. It says, Nature, wake this. Wait. Nature, wake this. We just little things make. <laughs> I don't have my glasses on that well. My reading glasses, that is. Classic poo. And this is a 6 to 12, but it will definitely look cute on her. Once spring and summer actually come. But I wonder if this. Whew, like a mad breath. I wonder if this onesie will. I wanted to put this on underneath the strawberry. Um, where I live in northern Canada, the snow is pretty much gone. Yay! Friendly. And the weather has been beautiful. But today, right at this moment, is partly cloudy. So let's see how this onesie look on Sienna. Oh, <laughs> I always love, I don't know, you put on different clothing and it's like love all over again. So this fits her torso like pretty much like true to fit um oh she's heavy Let's see what size this is a gerber what you can see gerber zero to three one z Can you see her? Look at this chunk. Just heavy girl. You can tell she's just heavy girl. <laughs> she's so cute. Okay. So. Okay, those. There are snaps, but I'm just going to go from the bottom up. I also have something else to show you. I showed Instagram already. But I haven't showed you guys yet here on YouTube. Whoa! <laughs> Sorry, good thing this is just a doll. Oh my goodness, you have a heavy head. <laughs> and this fits her. I knew she would look so cute in this. It's like perfect. I think the Nino sculpt personally looks really amazing in romper style. <laughs> oh. Okay. Heavy girl, gotta do up your snaps. Let's see, tuck the... Oh, wait. Let's look at pick her up. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I think it looks very cute. And then the same hair back will look just as beautiful. Put these to the side. Now I'll show you. I'm so excited when I saw this in um, 
the I was looking for a plushie of Yona actually and because I do own a Yona if you've seen he's he's just over there but um I wanted one thinking about putting one onto a cuddle body because I really love Yoda, but the one that I have, he's just like has no legs or nothing, but I don't know. So I was thinking of getting another one to turn into a cuddle body. However, I saw something else. Oh, I'm so excited. So if you're on my Instagram, you would totally know what this is. But if you don't, look what I have. It's a tea. Oh my god. This is the first movie I saw in the theaters. And I was around, I think it was eight. I'm not sure how old I was. But I remember the jacket I was wearing. And I always carried Kleenex on me in the winter. Because I always had a runny nose. And I always came prepared. And I remember there's this sad scene on E.T. And... Um, I remember trying to get into my jacket and I couldn't, the, snap, the snaps on it were really hard and plus I was sitting down in a chair and I was, I remember I went from feeling so sad and starting to cry to wanting to get into my jacket, my coat, and I couldn't so it quickly turned into frustration. <laughs> like, yeah, I'm trying to get my Kleenex. <laughs> my tears are just rolling more and more and more. Anyways. I am so excited. This is... Oh, here's the back. Well, let's open it, first of all. Oh, he has... He has cool eyes. Look. <laughs> I'm so happy. Yes, the long fingers. <gasps> I love. Oh my goodness, he has a red jacket on. <laughs> for him. Oh my goodness, look, he has a red hoodie. <gasps> and it comes off. Does it zipper? Oh, it zippers! Ah. Okay. Um, on the back, before I rip it apart, before I take money, eh? E.T. the extraterrestrial. E.T. phone home in the backyard meeting with a flower of candy. Mm. 40, 40 year anniversary. Oh. Wow. Okay, I need to get him out. This is try me, try me. What do you mean? What? So maybe my plans won't. <gasps> what? I do own the movie, by the way, but I never watched it in, like, a long time. I didn't know he was interactive. Maybe my plans for him won't. I was going to put him onto a cuddle body, but I don't know now. Ooh. Didn't want to hurt any part of it. Ah, look. <laughs> His feet are stuck. His hoodie comes off. Yeah. I don't want to wreck his box too much. Oh, okay. I was going to put him onto a kind of body, but 
you know what is should cover more of his face you're missing it's missing some material should be covering more it should be uh, ouch. Yeah, these things these clothing it's like a clothing tag oh i have to cut that okay can his can you actually take off his jacket i don't know no it's connected you can unzip it that's all oh i was gonna have plans for this guy i was going to put him on the cuddle buddy but i can't destroy him he's made too good oh his his back opens up i really was going to put him onto a cuddle buddy but he's made to i don't think his battery pack he's made too well <laughs> I'm so happy to have him. Oh my goodness, look at the back of the head. I could just see him running around. Oh. Uh, ouch. Yeah, ouch. Thank you. Hmm. I was going to put him on cuddle body. But he's too, he's too good. <laughs> I wonder if I could find a cheaper plushie. Maybe a different, look at his eyes. Like. Oh, E.T. <laughs> I was going to put him on to a cuddle body, but I don't think I want to now. But I did want to share with you. See, I have a stash of cloth bodies from McPherson's in Canada because I am Canadian. And it's the easiest place for me to get bodies. But uh, I was going to share with you my stash and find, see if I had a cuddle baby like a cuddle body preemie I think I do but I have a 22 full limb non-jointed so oh I have a 22 inch bundle baby cuddle baby so not bad this is an 18 inch full limbs no joints um, the reason why is because I have a lot of dolls that I decided I would like to upgrade from their old, old bodies to their newer ones. So, I bought all these. Because at first, like years ago, when I thought about upgrading my dolls into a newer, nicer body. Because you know how now they have like their, their plush, or what's this called? <laughs> <laughs> oh plush what's it called gathered <laughs> gathered chest and gathered bottom i wanted to upgrade and i have a whole bunch of old-fashioned dolls in my collection however some i don't know if i want to change out or not anymore um here i am rambling again i was going to tell you that years ago I did want to upgrade these dolls. Um, yeah, actually, I probably will upgrade them eventually because their old-fashioned bodies are like, there's no gathered chest or no gathered, um, like, bottom. So, 
they're kind of plain, especially when you um, change them. I don't know. <laughs> but at that time, I thought, I already spent all this money on this Reborn doll. Why would I spend another, however much these are, $15, to upgrade them when I already spent so much on them? The thought, to me at that time, the thought of upgrading a doll I already bought seemed like, like, why? Like, why do it? Why spend even more money? But now I changed my mind to upgrading because I already learned how to reweight the dolls, which I'm so thankful I learned how to do that. And now I thought, you know what? I might as well upgrade the bodies too. Why not love them how I want to love them and not just accept them as they are? I wanted for them to be um, accepted fully so that the bond can be stronger if that makes sense to you let's see what else i have um 18 inch three quarter arm full legs back in the day i did have a lot of like three quarter arm three like here oh a 14 inch cuddle baby this is what i wanted to turn him into i don't know i might have to pull this out and see what it might look like I don't know, though. I don't know if I can... Because, I mean, you can always transfer the mechanism into these. But I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. And this is... Uh, what is this? I can't really see with all my reading cards. 16 inch? Full limbs? Is that, I didn't think there was a 16 inch. Or is that the 18 inch? I totally can't see the same with the camera. Except eighteen inch. That's a banyan. This one twenty-two inch. I put that into a newer bag because when I received it, it was totally. Sometimes they come to me like all rolled up, and not even in one of these kind of bags. They're like in just all rolled up and put into a different bag so I put it into a ziploc bag and just put the label on top 22 inch flesh on suede uh, three quarter legs oh here's another bundle of baby I got an eight, 18 inch these bundle babies I bought the bodies I bought were the ones where I have a couple of dolls where I love the face I don't enjoy their limbs at all, like mostly in their arms. I have, a, I have a couple of dolls like that. So I thought, might as well turn them into, um, into cuddle babies. This is a 16 inch, really 16 inch? I thought they weren't, didn't exist. Yeah, 16 inch. <laughs> oh, I feel old sometimes. Um, Three quarter armful legs and my oh two more, eighteen inch full limbs and twenty inch full limbs. Yeah, I did have a cuddle body in that fourteen. Where did I put it? Oh, it's right there. A fourteen inch preemie might work. Would work for ET. But I don't. I don't know if I want to, like, because he is well made. And he has this. How can I break that finger? <laughs> I don't think I can. I can't. I, okay, I can't. I can't destroy him. I might have to buy another. ET to do that too. But first I should roll out this 14 inch body and see how it would look. Fourteen inch cuddle body. I'm just gonna see how long like 
how it would compare up to his body. It's not put together. I'd have to assemble it, but this is okay. Let's just take out this part. Oh, it's so cute! <laughs> it's a gathered chest. Another tiny gathered. Let's see. See? I think. I think it would work. But I don't want to. I didn't know he was interactive. I didn't. I just saw him and I thought I need him. Oops. I just saw him and I thought I really needed him. Even his hood feels. His fleeced hood. You need a bike. I need to find you a bike. A doll bike. Put a basket on it. Put a moon. Yeah. See, I think this would fit. And then let's see how long this is a leg. So his legs would be like longer. But he would be a really cute cuddle baby. But I don't know if I can. I can't destroy this one. I'm going to have to look for other ETs to like not interactive if if any exist. <laughs> so news guys, I should go um go make supper. Oh. So news guys, hope that you're having a great day. Thank you so much for being here. I love all of you that come by and leave a comment and leave a like. I appreciate you guys so much, and I hope that you're having a beautiful and wonderful day. And until next time, guys, very soon, because I love being here. Until next time, guys, love you. Bye, Munchan. Munchan, guys. Bye.